Designed to tackle the most extreme terrain, the APH-01 is the most advanced prototype T3 to date. From the workshops of Apache Automobile, the APH-01 is a URO, an unidentified rolling object in the world of Rally Raid. Two of them are here at the Africa Eco Race, and who better to talk about them than the drivers themselves? It's the very first T3 hybrid, so it's half combustion and half electric. We always have two-wheel drive on the combustion engine, and we have a boost of around 50 brake horsepower that goes to the front wheels, so we can be in difficult conditions with two electric drive wheels and two traditional drive wheels. They've tried to make it from recycled materials, flax fibre, basalt fibre and recycled carbon fibre. It's a combustion engine with a Peugeot engine. It's a hybrid engine at the front, so it's electric. There's no transmission between the front and rear. And then, of course, you have to recharge the batteries. The batteries are close to the ground. You have to recharge them so that it gets to the dunes with enough battery power to be able to use it. We're learning about the car, we're learning about fuel consumption because we have about 30 litres less than the other SSVs. So we're learning every day. The car has a really incredible chassis and the power when you can go all out on fuel consumption is a really great machine. However, this is a rally raid. There are a lot of factors to manage and it's impossible to manage them all. But the team is doing the best it can. At the wheel, it's a bit more than a simple SSV. They are completely different from what these two drivers are used to. Gauthier Paulin, former runner-up in the Motocross World Championships, and Pierre-Louis Loubet, WRC specialist. A lot of fun, because what impresses me is how well it takes the knocks. They're really quite impressive machines. So far, so good. It will be extraordinary if in Dakar we are on top. But it's not over until it's over. The goal is pretty clear for the Apache team. It's not just about the numbers. The goal is to be happy in Dakar and to be happy in Dakar, of course, is to have done everything to be good, to have no regrets. The goal is to stay focused on myself and myself alone. Continue to win stages, have fun and continue to learn as much as possible about the car. For the moment, all is well for Gauthier Paulin and Pierre-Louis Loubet as they sit in 1st and 10th place, respectively.